Let us open up our Bibles to Matthew chapter 27 and read verse 46. It says there, And about the ninth hour, Jesus cried out with a loud voice, saying, Eli, Eli, lama sabachthani. That is, my God, my God, why have you forsaken me? The word forsaken comes from the word enkat alipo, which means to be deserted or to be left behind. That means Jesus felt he was alone on that cross. If he felt that the Father had left him. Why? Because he chose to take the sin of man upon him. Now you and I need to understand that sin is the reason that there is a division between God and us. And what Jesus did is the reason that was dividing God from us, he took it upon himself so that now you and I would be accepted by the Father. Come on, isn't that amazing? So you and I need to know that when we come to the saving knowledge of Jesus, when we accept him as our Lord and Savior, when we repent of our sins and come to him, we begin to see that we are the beloved of God. He took that feeling of being forsaken. He took that rejection upon himself. He took that being alone. He took it upon himself so that you and I would know what it is to be accepted by the Father in heaven. So today when you're going through your crisis, when you're going through those tests and trials of life, when you feel that nobody around you loves you, when you feel there is no one who stands with you, people who committed to help you, to bring you out of that pit, just left you, well, I want to tell you, you are not forsaken by God. God has not left you alone. He is with you and he will never leave you alone. Isn't that amazing? But one thing you and I need to know, he took, that is Jesus took it upon himself. He took sin upon himself. He took rejection upon himself. He took that being forsaken upon himself so that you would be accepted, so that you would be the beloved, so that you would experience the goodness, the favor of God. And one thing you need to always know in your walk in this world, we will always see the faithfulness of God because he will never forsake us never leave us alone. Why? Because Jesus took it all upon him on that cross. Isn't that amazing? Once again, I want to tell you, you are not alone. Why? Because Jesus took it upon himself. God bless you.